everybody. Cherished Messy Painter here. I am doing a fun uh, puddle pour with a swipe. My colors are Amsterdam Greenish Blue, Master's Touch Ocean Green. I have Amsterdam's, uh, what is this one called? Sky Blue Light. Uh, this, that's a cool name. I love that name. I have this Pouring Masters ready to pour, and this one you don't add anything to it. No Floetrol, no water, no nothing. It's pretty thin. Um, this is the Blue Gold Iridescent, so I'm only going to use a little bit of this because it creates cells on its own, and I really don't want this to overtake the swipe, so um, we'll see what happens by adding this. I'm using a little bit of the Iridescent Blue Green by Pebio Studios. Love this color. I have a really fun color shift um, by Folk Art. This one is Aqua Flash. And then for my swipe, I have the Amsterdam's Titanium White mixed with Floetrol and water. Uh, most of my colors have gloss medium in it, water, and Floetrol. And these are my swiping tools. And maybe even this. This is a spatula I got from the Dollar Tree. And I love it. It's great for, um, I love anything that has a bend to it. So, but this might be too big for this 10 by 20 canvas. This is a uh, gallery wrapped canvas, so it is quite thick on the sides. I have gone ahead and put some of the ocean green uh, color down since that's going to be my main color. And I am going to try not to make a big mess, but who cares if I do? All right, here we go. Wish me luck. I don't usually do this technique.
I am in love with this. I have not torched it yet, so we're gonna see what happens as soon as I torch it. I forgot to say one of the ingredients that I used in my swipe. Um, it is Amsterdam's, um, a titanium white. It is Floetrol and it is water. But I learned from the left brain artist, David, to add this. This is Penetrol oil-based additive instead of Floetrol, made by the same company, Flood. And it does smell a little bad, so I only used five drops of it in my, my small cup of white. But this acts like Australian Floetrol. I'm going to watch this as this dries and, and make sure nothing cracks, but I did another experiment with this and it worked great and nothing's cracked since then. I cannot tell you how much I love the results of this. I am probably gonna hurry up and do a 10 by 10, I mean a 12 by 12 as soon as I'm done with this, or maybe even a bigger one, because I just truly love this. So I'm gonna torch it and we're gonna see what happens. If you can come up with any color combos you want to see me try on this technique, please let me know. All right, well, the next time you guys see this, hopefully it's dry and looks awesome. So, see you in a little bit. It's dry. It is my new favorite. I say that a lot. I'm being completely serious. This is my new favorite. I love this. I love how it looks like it's an underwater camera shot. I, I just love all the lacing and then the cells that I got through here. It came out really much better than I thought. I'm definitely gonna experiment some more with the Penetrol. Um, I have to say that um, the colors I'm hoping will show, I'm trying to see right now if it shows it, but there are some really gorgeous teal and turquoise in here that when I tried taking a picture on the wall, it looked all blue, but it's not. The colors of this in person are just absolutely amazing. I really hope you guys like this video. Please give me a comment if you can think of a name for it and give me a thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you very much for watching.